I got a comment earlier that was saying uh, that I had to clean this at home skin. <laughs> I completely hear it. <laughs> I'm only wearing these because what's it called? The other ones I left in my garage. And usually I wear those AI sunglasses things so I can ride my motorcycle at the same time. But either way, that's not how I want to start the video. We have a day. Recording pack day today, the award ceremony at the Red Awards tonight with me and the team and also my wife will be there. And a bunch of other real estate companies will be there. Third hand from, from Ronnie Manhattan will also be there, which I'm in. We shot that whole first season finally out. So that's out. And well, that will be out for the fourth. So uh, make sure to tune in. But today should be good, guys. So, um, yeah, no, Red Awards. Night. Heading over to grab the motorcycle right now. We have a couple of meetings. We're launching Pine with this just launched Family to Brunch, which is a fantastic unit in Dumbo. Dumbo is a phenomenal area. There's very, very little inventory. There's very, very limited um, places you can build, basically. Everything is taken up. There's a lot of restrictions in that area as well, sort of under the bridge. I will be making a speech there as well. As I accept the award, we will make sure to include that in this video as well. When you guys will be seeing it, it will likely be Friday, which is when the premiere sort of red carpet convention is for the show when it comes out. Got a new video after it. So, that's that. So, it's the next morning. Unfortunately, I did not get that much video yesterday, but there is video. There's a full length one actually, and there's coming official videos, but. Um, no. Norm. Hi, baby. There's official videos coming, of course, from the award ceremony. And then tonight we have the red carpet event. So, um, we will be recording that too. I'll be trying to, at least. So, I'll keep going. But basically, didn't have full video. You guys will see this without the full video from yesterday. So, you're going to get little snippets here. Here you go. Break normal. the full thing okay, we're gonna post the whole thing at the end of this video go see the world and just show them what it really means to live life golden yeah we'll go then baby girl we'll go then they about to see it shine just we'll go then they can never break us down just we'll go then they about to see us glow just we'll go then yeah we'll go then baby girl we'll go okay so we just wrapped up at the Netflix premiere party uh, photo shoot up thing. Watch out for it, it is coming June 28th. 28th, June 28th. But I also wanted to point out something here. The Next Gen team, we are fucking killing it. Everything is going fantastic. So shout out to the team, shout out to Highline Residential, shout out to the entire gang. We are closing two deals this week alone. We are launching four listings here in Vada. 111 Fulton Street, uh, 20 Pine, there's two in 20 Pine, uh, 2304 and 2403. 111 Fulton, we're launching actually a corner unit, and that one is a two bedroom, 711, funny enough. And we're launching another project, which I'm not gonna tell you guys about, it is gonna be in Soho, but we wanna surprise you guys because this is sort of gonna be the stable of what we are gonna be doing. So I hope that one will inspire you guys and I, I really look forward to it. But I wanted to say thank you to the team and that, you know, awards is nice, show is nice, but the business is where it's at, right? So that's what we're trying to showcase. So we gotta keep that running. But hope you guys enjoy it. So we just got back. I've been doing a vlog from this past two days. So I did the Were you doing pizza? <laughs> <laughs> That's going in there. So, we got back. Two days back to back. Now it's uh, chill time. We're closing two deals this week alone, launching four. And, um, that's it. Make sure to tune in June 24th for the Netflix show. 28th. 
that's it. Make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and that's it. That's it. Have a good weekend. Yes? Okay, cool. I, I assume that's a yes. Yeah? Yes, yes. Okay, so first of all, thank you. Red Awards for this. I, I really do appreciate it. But um, I want to I wanna point out a couple of analogies. And uh, this has sort of been the year of analogies for me. And I hope that they do not offend you guys. So I'll start with the one that I think is the least offending one. The least offending one, and actually I was supposed to be the last speech, right? I sort of you know, blame that on you a little bit. But, so the least offending one is this, and this has sort of been the year of me learning a lot in real estate, right? And I think everybody in here knows that real estate in general hasn't changed a lot over the years. Can we sort of agree with that? Yeah, no? If you don't admit it, then you're just, okay, yeah, never mind. This might be the bad one as well. Either way, so how I think of the team that's sitting right here, that's fantastic, and why we've been able to do what we're doing, and my lovely wife as well, um, and Philip, who's also in here. Either way, the way we've been able to do it is that basically, if you look at any other business, right, it's done as, as a team, it's not done as, think of it like this. If you have a soccer team, and a soccer team is all goalies, you have a pretty shitty team and they're gonna fail every time. That's basically what real estate is. And it's been like that forever. And I don't really see why. I know I'm really, really bad at something, but I'm also amazing at other things. So if I hired someone to do something that I was amazing at, I would be better than that person, but they would be doing the same thing. And we wouldn't be producing a better product, right? So that's number one. And that, I don't think that's insulting. I think that's an advice, right? Um, second thing is this. So I hear about the market all the time. I hear about, oh, the market is bad, the market is down, this, this, and that. It, that part just doesn't make sense to me. Real estate is in liquid, and also I'm not in finance. So if anyone's in finance, Talk to Colin, not me, because I cannot defend myself in that subject, or just listen to the analogy. So basically, so the markets, right, you're talking about the markets, and now the market is down, the market is up, and that's why we can't sell. If you can't sell because of the market, then what's the difference between you guys and Robinhood, right? So I just, again, this is supposed to be motivated. I wanna, I wanna make that very, very clear. And basically, you know, I think real estate and how Street Easy and Silo has done it has sort of ruined the, the fun of it, right? We have made it very uh, interesting and entertaining to watch because of people like Ryan Serhan, for example. So it's very interesting and people now enjoy it and it's fun to watch. So let's make it fun in real life, right? Because you can actually market it like a product. You can market it like a Lamborghini. You can do each apartment. We live in New York City, where anything above $5 million should be marketed as a product to a specific way and with a specific vision, right? But putting it on street easy, you're now comparing it to the market, and you're basically putting like a, you know, a G-Shock, a Rolex, and a Fiat, and a Ferrari, and a bunch of other shit in the same class, and then calling it the market. So again, I hope that's that's motivational because it's fantastic, and what, what we have been able to do here is is great. So I'm excited for the future, guys. So thank you.